What is anemia? Anemia is a disease characterized by reduction, decrease in the hemoglobin concentration inside the red blood cell, also reduction in the red blood cell count, and the hematocrit or packed cell volume below the normal for age and sex. We should consider the age. It differs from uh, children to adult to elderly and sex male female. We have to consider the normal ranges are different in each category. The main function of hemoglobin transport gas oxygen and CO2 oxygen from the lung to the cells and CO2 from the cells to the lung. So the clinical features of anemia or clinical diagnosis of anemia we will uh, find the compensatory mechanism to hypoxia, which occurred due to decrease in the red blood cell count and the hemoglobin concentration. Hypoxia, which occurred in anemia, leading to adaptation. Adaptation of the body, adaptation of the heart by increasing the heart rate and increasing the stroke volume in order to compensate. So, clinically, in the clinical uh, signs and uh, uh, symptoms you that patient will uh, complain from palpitations and we will uh, notice tachycardia tachycardia as a clinical sign for anemia uh, the clinical features are divided into symptoms and signs symptoms the complaint of the patients and signs uh, which we notice on the patient from the examination Symptoms, shortness of breath or dyspnea, especially on exercise because of hypoxia, palpitation because of the adaptation of the body to the hypoxia, weakness and fatigability because of hypoxia of muscles, headache and confusion and the lack of concentration because of hypoxia. Signs of anemia are also divided into general and specific. General signs are seen on all types of anemia, while uh, specific signs of anemia are characterized uh, for, uh, for each type. Uh, for general, we will start by general. We can see here pallor, pallor of the skin, pallor of the mucous membrane. Uh, you can see here the pallor of the palm of the hand in comparison with normal. Here is normal and here build the palm, tachycardia from the radial pulse, you can measure the radial pulse and the auscultate the heart rate and you can do in the laboratory or the uh, EC, uh, uh, investigations, ECG, you can see the uh, tachycardia. Specific features are associated with specific types of anemia, as we mentioned. Uh, examples, uh, spooning nail or colonicia, colonicia. You can see here concavity of the nails, which occur in iron deficiency anemia. It is commonly in iron deficiency anemia. Jaundice or yellow, yellow discoloration of the sclera. You can see this is a yellowish sclera instead of the white normal color. Jaundice occur in hemolytic anemia. So. Uh, we can uh, know the type of the anemia from the specific sign. Another specific sign is the leg ulcer. You can see here ulceration of the leg, which occurs with uh, sickle cell anemia. We will discuss uh, sickle cell anemia later on in details. And bone deformities, you can see protrusions here in the face, which occur with thalassemia. Because anemia uh, has uh, many causes, so we have to classify anemias. According to red cell indices, which we mentioned before, MCV, MCH, and MCHC, we can find three main types. Normocytic, normochromic uh, anemia. In the middle, it is normocytic, normochromic anemia. And the microcytic hypochromic anemia to the left, 
you can see hypochromic this is hypochromic microcytic small red blood cell you can see small red blood cell with anisocytosis variation in the volumes and shapes of the red blood cells macrocytic anemia anemia with very large mcv you can see large red blood cells you can compare between the large and the normal and micro Normocytic normochromic anemia. So, the definition it is anemia with normal MCV, MCH, and MCHC. Normocytic normochromic anemia include hemolytic anemias except thalassemia. Aplastic anemia. We will discuss hemolytic anemia and aplastic anemia in details, in depth later on. Microcytic hypochromic anemias means. Anemia with decreased MCV, MCH, and MCHC, which include iron deficiency anemia, which is the most common type of microcytic hypochromic anemia, most important, and thalassemia, which is a hereditary disease due to marriage of the relative's mother and the father. We will discuss thalassemia later on in detail because it's very important disorder. Macrocytic anemias with increased MCV, which occur in megaloplastic anemia due to vitamin B12 deficiency and folic acid deficiency. 